Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Learn in a Nutshell. So let me do one thing. Uh, let me import the uh, data first, some dummy data into this. I'll just create a new container. Let me give the name as demo container. Let me give ID as the partition key as that's a common field. Now let me create create this. So for dummy data, if you want to, if you want the dummy data, what you can do is search for Azure Cosmos DB demo data. It will uh, bring up Microsoft's official link. Click on that, and there's an option called Browse Code. Click on this. Click on Sample Data, and you can download this one. So you can click on this to download the raw file. Once downloaded, you can import to this container. So there is no direct option to import uh, data to this uh, container. So we'll use the migration data migration tool. For that, just search for Azure Data Migration Tools GitHub, and uh, it should uh, you know bring up the GitHub uh, URL. So here, click on this Azure Cosmos DB Data Migration Tool. It will show all the repo code here. We don't require all these things. On the right hand side, you will see releases. Click on releases and uh, download this zip file. So I've already downloaded it and also extracted it. Once you download and extract, you should see all the files over here like this. And there should be two files dt.exe and there should be another file called dtui.exe so dt.exe is for if you are if you want to use this tool via the cli or command prompt or if you prefer the user interface so you can use that they have created a very uh, good user interface as well just double click this so it will bring up this window so there is a uh, source information target information which we need to provide so currently what we'll be doing is we'll be importing data to demo 100 so here let's open this bring up this um, data migration tool in source information just select json file and click on add files select the demo data which you downloaded volcano data.json is, is the one which I downloaded click on open click on next here it is asking where you want to uh, um, what is the target information where you want to import this so I'll just give uh, the Azure Cosmos sequential record import and you'll have to provide the connection string and collection so go to keys in demo 100 there will be option for keys click on this i click on copy this is the connection string paste it here click on verify so it will throw an error to fix this error just give database and provide the database name demo db is the database name if you see here demo demo db now click on verify again so it's successfully connected now we'll have to provide the collection name so collection name is nothing but the container demo container is the name let me give that and you can give the partition key as well click on next if you want to log all the errors then you can create a you know error log file as of now i'll just skip this click on next you'll see all the summary over here just click on import so you should see the numbers coming up in transferred 
so it started to come there are about 1500 data so meanwhile you can just check if it has come or not over here directly click on items so you can see all the datas are coming up it's getting imported so the import here is done to we have imported the data to demo 100 and it's that simple so hope this was helpful guys uh, let me know if you liked it uh, if you like it uh, it, will it will also let youtube know that you are liking the video and it will be suggested to a lot of people as well so please do with the like button and do subscribe if you like uh, the contents what i do and also if you have any queries please uh, please post it in the comment section i will uh, you know definitely reply to all the queries which you have so yeah that's all hope you all like the video so let's catch again in the next video until then see you bye